fast and extra quick. How quickly you, did you guys flush the win at Tennessee? Because there, there, was all, there was talk about you guys, uh, this is a trap game, you know, you could be down after, after the emotional blow. Like, how, how, did you, how did you flush that so quickly? We flush every game, every Sunday. You know, we come in, we get us a lift in, you know, we watch our plays, you know, our corrections, and you know it's already on to the next game. After, after, after Saturday and Sunday, you know, we, we enjoyed the win, we got the win, now on to the next. So. Did anyone mention clinching the SEC East after this game in the locker room? Oh, yeah. That was a, you know, it was a big accomplishment, you know, big milestone for us. You know, we've been working hard towards it, you know. I love this team. I love, you know, how we keep fighting and keep grinding to the end, you know. Hopefully we can uh, get to Atlanta and, you know, uh, finish it out. But, you know, we're still taking it one game at a time. So I just look forward to, you know, taking it one game at a time next game and, you know, keep preparing. So I think uh, Kirby, I remember before the, or after the Missouri game, talked about how y'all sat around the hotel all day and everything. is kind of the same thing today. What was y'all trying to do anything differently? So you came out a little bit better this time. And, yeah. We just already knew what to expect, you know, instead of sitting around the hotel, you know, a couple of us got up, got together, you know, went downstairs, walked around the hotel a little bit so you won't be sitting there just getting sleepy and not knowing what's going on, you know. Some people watch film, some people watch TV just like to relax, and, you know, I think that helped out a lot. Yeah, I mean, this is a win on the road. Yes, I do. What time did y'all go to? What time was it? Probably like two, three, something like that, right before we left, you know, just being able to, you know, refreshing your body and just being able from, to get up and not be so lousy and lazy, you know, so we can start fast. And play How do you feel you guys responded when they brought it close? You know, halftime was a little bit of drama. What was the message and how did you like how you guys responded? You know, it's always next play mentality, so we just try and keep that up. And, you know, it, it was right before halftime we knew we had the ball coming out, so we just tried to take it and, and run it down their throat the same way we did and, you know, just answer quick and keep the crowd out of it. How happy are you guys to see a guy like Lad go off? He seems like revered by the whole team. I love Lad, man. Lad's my guy. Lad is he, he extremely hard worker, you know. I love to see him succeed, you know, and hopefully he can keep going. So just seeing him succeed and seeing all the work he puts in, you know, it makes me happy as a, a player and a person because, you know, that's my brother and I want him to succeed as well. So, so you love Vlad so much. You actually get to see him in practice and we don't. <laughs> what makes him so special beyond what he does on Saturdays? Because he just, he just comes in ready to work, you know. Like, he's just one of those players that doesn't take no for an answer. Like, he's going to find a way to do something uh, positive and, you know, be be effective in the game. So any, any way he try to implement himself into the game plan, any, any way Coach Munkin tries to do that, you know, he always takes it uh, one step at a time, and, you know, just in practice. I can see him taking steps and, you know, just taking coaching and just being able to be him and not trying to be somebody who's not. You know, that's really what makes me love that. So. Uh, Lad, it's, it's, you know, his birthday was yesterday, so we can't keep calling him young. He's 21 now. <laughs> you know, I, I talked to him about that, but just, just seeing him because you know we're the same class just seeing us come in together and you know being able to grow and, and play more like me and him together it just it just makes me happy because I've seen like since we've been since we've been at Georgia us just coming in together and putting in the work and grinding together you know the long summers the spring and, you know everything so it all just plays a part like, and everything and, you know hopefully we can just keep going taking the game at a time what was the second half of the half 